And so, you know, back in the day, people would say that the, if you left it loaded too long, then the feed lips would bend over time and it would malfunction. So this is a test that is 12 or 13 years in the making. All right, so about 12 years ago, I loaded up, this is a Gen 1 P mag, and that was about when P mags were pretty new. And there was a lot of talk about whether or not they would uh, flex over time. And I thought it'd be a cool test to take one of these, load it all the way full with 30 rounds in it, and then, uh, let it sit in my safe for originally I was going to do it for 10 years and then I actually forgot I had it in there and the other day I, I found the mag full of ammo and I remembered what it was so I, I believe it's been about 12 years or maybe 13 years that this has been left loaded in my safe without the little uh, thing on the top to relieve the stress on the feed lips and so you know back in the day people would say that the if you left it loaded too long, then the feed lips would bend over time and it would malfunction. So this is a test that is 12 or 13 years in the making. And we're just gonna test to see if they feed or if they don't and what has happened in the last 12 or 13 years. So I guess if you're watching right now, leave a comment and see if you think this will fail or succeed. So here we go. And we're testing for functionality, not my aiming with iron sights. <laughs> Just a reminder that I decided to do this test out of my curiosity, and this was long before I started making videos. If I were to do it again, I'd probably throw about 10 loaded PMAGs in my safe and do the same test, or maybe even stagger it by year. Okay, ready? You could do yep. So at least it chambered the first one fine. But you know the bullet. Yeah. It weighs 36 grains. Okay. And you know the velocity of the gun is 12 grains. We'll try a couple rapid fires. Look up the math. You're right, it's complex math. All 30 rounds. After 12 years. 12 or 13 years, man. That, man, that's a, a pretty good, I guess, testimony to these. Gen 1 P Mag. I don't even think they make this color anymore. Maybe they do. It's like a weird green. Yeah, it's like their, their precursor green. Yeah, it was their first generation green. But, uh, cool. So, I'm totally ex excited that it worked. So, if any of you, I mean, obviously if it's left in the sun and stuff, the polymers <laughs> might break down, the glass-filled nylon or whatever it's made out of, but uh, left in the safe without the stress reliever, it totally worked fine. 